Hello, MechWarriors! How's it going? And welcome to another episode of MechWarrior 5 Mercenaries Heroes of the Inner Sphere modded! I actually downloaded some mods because I wanted to change the game and I want to see what craziness we can bring on the battlefield here. So, the list of mods uh, is seen here. As you can see, I'm running Pirate Tech Lite. Pirate Tech adds a lot of new mech variants and new exclusive mechs. New mechs that are not in the base game, not in the DLC. They actually modded it so that uh, I think there are Stingers and Wasps and, uh, you know, some other mechs that you will see here. Uh, also, new equipment. I, I'm super, super excited to see how the new equipment plays. I'm using Volatile Mod because it gives us more effects and goes, you know, it gives us more explosions and, and missile trails and stuff like that. And then Coyote's Mission Pack because um, I wanted more mission types and Coyote added some more. There is like a big battlefield, there is uh, recon missions now, there are patrol missions. Uh, you will see that, guys. It's amazing. So, I don't know anything about it yet, but I'm gonna dive in with you and we're gonna start a new career. And the cool thing is, you can start as a pilot, a uh, pirate, a pirate pilot with only a commando. And I think this is a good experience here because we can really go from zero to hero. Because a single commando is not much and um, we will probably suffer a little bit in the early game. But hey, let's see. Let's see what we can do here. Single commando to rule them all. It's gonna be amazing, guys. So I took a very, very brief look at uh, at the new weapon systems in instant action mode, very shortly. Didn't even play with them, um, because I want to learn the game while playing, and uh, I hope you don't mind. So I'm also going to skip all the tutorials. If you haven't seen uh, the MechWarrior 5, uh, any MechWarrior 5 content or any content of the DLC, I would highly recommend watching my other playlist with the vanilla DLC. Uh, to know what's going on here. Otherwise, welcome in, guys. We are going modded. Uh, let's take a look at the battle mech. We have um, a Commando 7X. 7X runs 97 kph. That's pretty good. And I cannot do anything with it. All right, it runs an SRM-6 and three medium lasers. That's very solid. But I'm probably on a planet where I have no... Yeah, where I have no nothing. We are in the center of the inner sphere. And we are pretty far in the timeline because Steiner Devian is already a thing. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. But since we are... Since we are here... Should we go for them? Oh, here you can see. This is attack and defend. Um, that's really nice. I cannot really attack and defend yet because I only have one mech. This is a battlefield contract, which is also not really advised. Heavy recon contract. Oh god, I, I'm a... Can we even play those missions? They say level 1 to 15. Does it mean that the missions now scale with my rating? With my company rate? I don't know. I don't know. I mean, we can certainly try to play a demolition contract because our mech is fast enough to get that done. Um, sure, we're gonna try to make our way to the outskirts of this whole, you know, inner sphere. Because I believe you can find missions out there? Maybe? I don't know. That are lower tier. Currently, we have a single commando, nothing else. It's real hard mode, but I love it. So, we need to get some money mm, in order to actually get this done, because currently we have 800,000 sea bills, and that is not much. That's a level 93 demolition. Ah, and that's a level 23 raid. Haha, -ha, interesting. Can we play that raid? We might be able to do that. Sure. All right, let's go for it. Uh, Siebel payout. Should we go for Siebels? That's a lot of Siebels, actually. Am I gonna take the salvage? No, I'm gonna take the money. We're not really getting so much money after that. Uh. Do I take air strike? Sure, we'll take an air strike. Oh god, let's go, guys. A single commander to rule them all. I really hope that we can defend ourselves against the tanks that are coming up and the, the turrets. I'm not gonna try to engage any mechs. And I try to just go in, destroy the objective, and then get the hell out again. Because we are not really combat ready for a level 19 mission. That is way too much. Okay, Commando. All right, We've let's go. We've been slated for a raid deep into enemy territory. To take out a number of satellite systems, our employer has marked on your map. All right. We will monitor your progress. And All right. set an evac point for pickup once the targets have been destroyed. Cool. Airstrike support is available on this mission. I'll let you know when they reach the target area. Right, can I... Nope. Uh, that means it's this way around. I'm not gonna attack this. Mechs in 
Oh god. Yeah, he's gonna eat me. So I have to defend myself, huh? Ah! SRM carrier. Yeah, I, I better do it. Wait, what? What's that? I don't have lock on weapons. Oh, my SRMs are lock on now? Ow! Stop that. No! Leave me alone. <laughs> that AC2. All right, all right, all right. So the fleet didn't even engage, but I think I still had to destroy that tank. It was important. Okay. Let's see what we can do here. It's another light mech. Ooh. SRMs. That's a stinger. Hey, look at that. We have one of the new mechs on the battlefield already, and that's a freaking hunchback. Okay. Uh, can I get out of here? Run! Okay. We're good. We're fine. Let's get out of here. Oh, <laughs> Man, we really need that money afterwards. Yeah, I'm just trying to... Ooh, no, don't do that. To disengage. My right arm doesn't look great anymore. We have two more things to destroy. Stinger has a medium laser and machine guns. Oh, yeah. And there's also a tank. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Uh. Wait. I, I don't know how those lock-ons work. But they are dumb fire, right? Yeah, they are. So, I don't know why. Why was the... Oh, God, that's big. Oh, my God. <laughs> Hello, party son. Let's not have a party together, okay? Alright. Heat critical. Also not great. I'm trying to destroy whatever it is. I think it's this one. Alright. Disengage. Oh, please, Artie Strike, destroy that thing, because I am not willing to die here. Alright, I, I I don't know where it is. Rihanna? Help! <laughs> Alright, we are done, guys. We're done. Complete, 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 complete. Oh, is that stressful? That is so stressful here. Look at those guys. <laughs> they also bring a dropship. Yeah, this is definitely a bit more dangerous than I thought it would be. Uh, let, let me try to take cover. Rihanna, help! Oh god. I try to just disengage, take a wide berth around them, and then get to the dropship. Get to the dropship, let's go! Uh, flyers? Yeah, he's down, that's good. Bam! Alright, I think we made it. Wow! Wow, a single commando. Yeah, whatever. I'm gonna get out of here. Try to not lose my left arm. Yeah, there it is. Go away, Blackjack. So yeah, my, my SRMs seem to lock on, but they still shoot straight. So, let's get out of here. Ooh, crazy first mission. And I mean, that was a level 19 raid, but at the same time, it gave us a good amount of money. So... We would be able to maybe pick up a friend? <laughs> How do I want to play this? Oh god. I mean, we are unknown. That's... Holy shit. Uh, that was a lot of reputation. We got a medium chemical laser, about 3 million C-bills, and... Hmm... An AC-5 as well as an SRM-2, I guess. Let's take it. Yay, first mission done. You transmission, except those. Oh, now we have cantinas. Yeah. I think the first mission you play gets you to the to the high reputation level already. Yeah, I'm definitely not gonna play the demolition mission to tier 93. That's not gonna happen. I will not be able to to just survive anything, yeah. Um anyway, let me go ahead and go. I think we're gonna make our way south here. Ooh, light recon contract. Maybe that's a mission that we wanna play. Uh, that means we're gonna quickly repair everything. I think I can get rid of that. I'm gonna max armor. Ah. What about lasers? I can take some small lasers here. Ah. Uh, do I take Inferno SR SRMs? Oh, I want to. But what are our energy options here? I don't know. I want to check out Infernos. I want to overheat my enemies. You know, just shutting them down. But I guess it's two small lasers to fix that again. And that allows us to keep ammo. I mean, I guess. Let's go. More ammo. Why not? Uh, wait a second. At the same time, 
We're not quite maxed out on armor. That's fine. No, it is not. It is not fine. Drop SRM ammo. Get that head armor up. Okay. Get that center torso armor up. We need like, I don't know, 7 here. Cool. 16, 16. And that's gonna be maximum as well. That's way better. I mean, we are slightly under tonnage, but I think that is fine. Yeah. Okay. We made the make better than it was before. I know I'm repairing in lots of money here in a, in a conflict zone. I want to go down here. Uh, it'll take us 20 days. I want to see if I can play the patrol mission because that's one of the new ones. And we got to check it out. I think it's pretty good with the, with the commando. Let's see. No idea what the objectives are there. We'll figure it out, guys. Maybe you have to go to, I don't know, different waypoints and not get caught or something? Light Recon 36. <laughs> Seven mission operation. What? Oh. <laughs> yeah, I, I cannot take it. How do we get missions that we can actually play? I am not really sure. So this says 1 to 15. 1 to 15. It's all 1 to 15. 13 to 14. Aha. 1 to 15. 13 to 14. I think I really have to get away from here. I should probably pick some things up from the cantina so we can get some extra money, extra equipment and some armor and uh, structural upgrades for later. That's gonna be interesting. I'm also thinking that I want to take a look at the <laughs> hero mech that is available there. Maybe it is something good. Maybe it's something better than the commando that we are running. We got 3 million, so we could be lucky. Ooh, that's a lot. Alright, kill J. Edgar for SRM. Kill warrior units for SRM. That's definitely a thing that we're gonna do. Treasure Hunter. Go to Davian Borderlands. No. Uh, single heat sinks. No. Equipment Collector. That's a lot of single heat sinks. What do you want? Three jump jets? I could just take him. Sure. Mech Hunter. Kill three assassins. That seems like a good idea. Small chem laser and ammo? Kill javelins, that's also gonna happen, I think. Kill urban max, that's definitely gonna happen. Collect one wolfhound. Shh, no, I wouldn't give away any wolfhounds right now. Alright, those are our six cantina missions. Take a look at the mech market, and I see a centurion. Huh. Now that is interesting. I could just pick up a scent and trade my commander for it. We have to build it though, we have to rebuild it. It's a, it's a laser one though. Ha ha ha, interesting. I don't think I want an AL right now. Honestly, what I want, is, I think I want to play a dervish at one point, but right now we don't have the funds to buy one. In terms of pilots, those are not really that great, but okay. We can pick up a pilot later. All right, so right now, Right now we're done here. I'm gonna go over to the next planet because there are two mechs that might be interesting and then we're gonna dive into another section where we can finally hopefully play a mission that is within our means of uh, finishing. So, <laughs> let's see. I would love to play a, a low tier demolition mission or something like that. That would be amazing. And by the way, guys, if you have any mod that you want me to see and play, then uh, let me know. I could possibly pick it up. Katana Cat would be amazing here. Oh boy. That is a very good light mag. Um, it comes with five double heat sinks and two PPCs and an SRM. That thing is amazing. It runs 64 kph only, so it's, you know, it's a slower mag. But for a light mag, it is so overgunned and so over equipped. Ah, we cannot pick it up though. It's not possible. Uh, anyway, let's take a look at the star map. We need to grind some money before we upgrade our mechs. There are a lot of missions available. Attack and defend multi-mission. Not really what I want. It's 1 to 15. We should, at the very least, take a look at those. Can I play defense? No. No, I can't. Unless it's, like, super low. Light recon and assassination. Maybe. So, I, I want to make my way to the outskirts of the inner sphere. In order to see if I can actually find better missions there. Oh boy. 
How am I supposed to win this? How am I supposed to to, to fight this here? Uh, is that the difficulty that we have to deal with? Just taking contracts above our difficulty level? It's 52. We are, we are getting so many heavy mechs in that territory. I'm not gonna do it. No. 1 to 15. Alright, let's go here. I'm, I'm willing to make some more jumps. Let's go. So, one commando is what we have. Demolition contracts are available. Raids are, are doable. Um, I don't know about these patrols and these recon missions, so I have no idea. Please give me something that's low. Battlefield, level 7. Yes! That's what we're going to be doing now. We also get a better payment here. That is 30 salvage shares. Ooh, I like that. I'm gonna take some extra money. That's five million. Wow. We're reading heavy weather warnings out there, Commander. All right, guys. I think this is how we're gonna get some equipment here. This is how we're gonna get some max quite quickly. Why is the payment so good? That is insane, guys. That's f that's a mech that we can buy, and we should. We should really get some friends around us before we do anything else. Upgrading that commando is, is... Nah, we're not doing it. We're just gonna get some uh, some other mechs that... That are probably in the medium mech bracket. Not even a heavy, maybe. Let's check it out. So, eliminate all hostiles. We have been dropped near the base. Enemies are approaching. Let's see if that's possible. Hello, enemies! So, that's a battlefield that we are playing. We have some allies, and there should be a crazy amount of enemies around here. Seven, to be honest. Hmm. I mean, so far I don't see anybody. Also, uh, what, what's that dropship zone here? Ah, it's not even here. Actually, let's take a look around and see if we can find some... What are they called? Some of these um, the caches, these loot caches. Maybe there's something hidden somewhere. So there's a dropship. Interesting. What? What? <laughs> alright, 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 alright. We need our friends to aggro those guys in order to not die, basically. So I'm gonna try to beat the battle buddy for my Centurion here. Oh, oh I love this. This is good. Imagine that with the soul max. What are you fighting? The flea? Alright, I'll try to get the flea quick. Alright, we got a flea. Let's disengage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The Centurion can have the fun. And hopefully attract some fire here. Fire starter. Oh god. Um, there's an urban mag. Okay, am I gonna go for the lighter ones here? Alright, come over here, Locust. Almost down. My heat is okay on the build, by the way. So we'll disengage again. My mech is not looking great. What? Did it go straight through him? I don't know. Again, this is all aggro management. Oh, wrong button. I have my weapon set up in a weird way. Alright, we'll try to take the Jenner because he's currently engaged with the other guys here. Here comes the fire starter. It's, I think, the most dangerous target right now. Alright, we'll take it out. We'll try. Try to be in his back. No! Back, I said! Uh oh. Come on! My arm is gone. And my side torso is... Ooh, not looking great, I gotta say. And this is where my ammo is, so if I lose my right side, I'm... I'm... Oh, no, 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 no. I'm out of uh, everything here. We need more mechs, guys. What a crazy battlefield that is. Man, I guess I have to wait for my allies to do things. Oh, wait, it's a Jenner. Ow! Still have SRM ammo. All right. And small lasers. I'm actually getting confused with the uh, with the lock on all the time. Okay, 
I'll go for it. It's a chem laser Jenner. Also, it's running in a very wacky way because he is he is pirate and oh my god, no. He is a supercharging uh, dude. I am about to lose the mission. Um, I mean, we have three more targets. I guess we're gonna wait for my allies to get things done. Cannot engage anymore. We gotta hide. I ca I'm gonna cheerlead those guys. <laughs> you can do it. Go for it. No problem. Should I help you? No. Probably not, because one hit and I'm done. Maybe maybe we can snipe. Maybe we can snipe with SRMs. That was the urban mech there. We hit him. Auto cannon 10 is down. I mean, we have 188 missiles left. That's definitely good enough. Oh no. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Leave me alone. <laughs> ah, he's going in my direction. I don't want any of that, please. Thank you. My starter is almost down. Is he going for me? Oh, nope. I'm out of here. <laughs> we need very slow DPS. This is too dangerous. The, that's, that's too dangerous. I don't want to lose the mission. That's the thing. Alright, fire starter is almost down. I want to help. Okay. Right, we got that guy. Let's disengage again. Oh no. Oh, there's the javelin. But he's getting shot in the butt now. That's pretty good. Ooh. I think we made it out alive. Hey, Jav. What's your deal, buddy? I need to leak my shots more if I'm shooting at that distance. Maybe they can get it done. I don't know if I need to help. Okay, so far so good. Don't you dare shooting me. Ah, missed it. I'm also stuck. Yeah, you can do it, guys. You can do it. All right, we got him. Proceed to evac zone. Yes, please. Thank you. I'm gonna proceed to the evac zone like no one has ever proceeded to any evac zone before. That was a crazy mission. And I cannot wait to play this type of mission with some um, AI pilots that I can command. More mechs and, and bigger mechs. Oh, beautiful. That was just a full attack of seven mechs at the same time. This is the amount of, um, of pressure that I want on missions. This is really good. Yeah, I always said that Warzone is a little bit too slow on the pacing because you have unlimited time to destroy your enemies, basically, and only then new enemies will spawn. But this is so much stuff at the same time. Beautiful. I love it. It's, it's really good. Let's get out of here. Pick me up, Rihanna! <laughs> Can't wait to see the other ones. I mean, my mech is done for, but we got so much money out of that that I think I'm just gonna buy myself another one and slap an AI, AI pilot on this uh, little commando. Yeah, five mil. I got two mechs now. Aha! Uh -huh. Let's take some medium lasers because they're, they're pretty good. Supercharger, wait. Um, medium laser machine gun, medium lasers, interesting. Um, I guess we'll take some small lasers. Some single heat sinks. That is an amazing amount of salvage here. All right. Definitely worth it. And we get some skill points. Pretty good. So, hello. I want to liberate something. Sure. No, not right now. Kill three Raven, kill three Jenners. Getting some good machine guns might be a good idea early on. Equipment collector. Streaks, reputation, just looking at the rewards here right now. Go to shipping route, no ammo, SRMs, no medium lasers, single heat sinks. Nothing I really want, so I'm gonna keep the ones that I have right now. It's fine. We got two mechs, and that's beautiful. So, let me go ahead and... The hero mech was here, right? The katana cat? Algod? It's a pretty long travel time. It might not be there anymore, 
when we arrive here. Huh. Actually, I want to make my way over here. Let's go to Kestrel. 27 days. And I want to pick up any mech there. And we need pilots, guys. We need pilots. Let's buy some mech warriors. Let's hire some mech warriors. Because we don't own them. We just pay them for their services for as long as they want to stay in our company. Or they die, whatever comes first. So... I'll pick you. I'll pick you. Alright, nothing interesting here. But there is a mech market. Oof. A cataphract. And we have enough money to afford it. There's a Jäger Mech S. Not really the greatest one. The Rifleman 3N is okay, I would say. But yeah, it's, a, it's an okay mech. It's alright. Do I just buy a Hunchback? I mean, the Rifleman is pretty costly. I could get myself a Cataphract. What would I do with it? Large Laser, AC-10, Double Medium, SRM. I would probably go Ballistic on it. Drop the SRM altogether. Go Medium, Lasers and Large. That's it. I would basically keep the build as is. The Rifleman has, you know, some interesting options though. It's too hot. That's the biggest drawback of the Rifleman. At the same time, let me take a look at the equipment here. They are... Oh, those chain cannons. Bus saw. It's an 8-ton weapon. Weight of fire is 33.333. <laughs> nice. It's uh, not the highest damage. Maximum range is also pretty bad. I want to check it out, though. We have to. Continuous discharge, medium pulse laser. Wait. Uh, with short burst. Ah, yeah, that's that thing. Okay, cool. Um, large continuous beam laser. Two of them. Seems good. You know what? We're gonna take the rifleman and build it, okay? I want that thing. So, go ahead and go make market. There's my rifleman. Is the Jäger better? Nah. I don't think so. I'll take my rifleman. Let's go. Bam! So, 2 million C-bills, and we have to build that thing. Uh, also, we need to build those guys, so let me quickly take a look. How much does it cost? It's not too much. It's, it's definitely doable. Maximum armor, 700,000, roundabout. Medium lasers are here, single heat sinks are here. And I'm gonna put two more in it. And that's the build. That's pretty much the build. I'll drop it down to seven on the back. Alright. Looks good, guys. That is a mech that we can definitely use. Then, a locust. Oh god, a locust. <laughs> are we even using that thing? Machine guns are not really that big of a deal. I think I'm gonna scrap the locust. Sell mech. I could buy or hire another pilot to actually gain experience already. It's a lot of money to, to do. No, actually, the cool thing is, I actually need to think about my, my money right now. And that, that's pretty good. I will rebuild the commander, though. Repair all. Take a medium laser here. Those are also mediums now. SRM ammo one ton. It's pretty good. Oh, it was on the left side also, by the way. Not on the right. And the rest of the mech are two single heat sinks. Actually, one single heat sink. Cool. Looking good, guys. Mm, let me go ahead and go for weapon groups. Spread them out a little bit. There we go. Weapon group C as well. Okay, so let's take a look at the Rifleman. It comes in okay state. I don't want those AC-5s though. I don't want those large lasers though. I want to check out those bus saws. <laughs> let's go. I only got one though. Not great. Let me take a look. Ooh, LBX is already there. Nice. Cemetery rifle. What is that? Now upgraded with a better barrel, a custom-designed Uber feed system. Ultra was trademarked. <laughs> and a lighter ammunition. Honestly, you're more likely to roast yourself than bludgeoning the enemy. But don't worry. You'll at least die while looking cool. 11 tons. Lots of damage. Good rate of fire. Crazy heat. Pirate Cemetery Uber Rifle. Coffin Rifle. 
30 damage. Max range is 200 meters. <laughs> all right. All right, all right, all right. Uh, Snubnose PPC is actually also quite cool. And the Therma Cutter. Uh, weighs nothing. Has no heat. Deals heat damage. And has no maximum range. So it's a it's a knife fighting thing. Interesting. Corrosive double heat sinks. Are you kidding me? More powerful but bulkier than a standard heat sinks. Cannot be equipped in the engine. Can explode for 10 damage. More likely to be damaged. Those are doubles. They have a heat capacity of 3 and an efficiency of 0 0.3. I want them. Double strength heat sink. Okay. Okay, more powerful than standard. More likely to be damaged. Okay, so they just explode. There are some doubles I should probably pick up. They are proto doubles as well. They seem to be the same. Alright, we're gonna buy some of those. Double strength heat sinks. Yeah, absolutely. I'm gonna buy all of them. <laughs> Why not? Alright, and um now we need to well, now we need to think about what we wanna build with our rifleman here. I mean, I definitely wanna armor up. Get that down to 10. Alrighty. Here we go. Get that down to 10. And I think I'll drop a little bit of leg armor in order to get to a full turn again. Like 50 is good. Then a bit of head armor. There we go. So all of the singles get out of here. I honestly want to play those continuous burn beam lasers or whatever they are called. Let me check them out. Large continuous beam laser. One, two. They are really expensive. Cool. Let me see what we can do here. Got two of them. Two mediums. And uh one auto cannon? Sure. Actually, if we're going that path, I'm gonna buy the the bus saw as well. I have to. <laughs> or one of those Uber rifles. Let me see. How do they work? Uh cemetery Uber rifle. 800,000 C bills. That's quite costly. Uh 23 days for the financial report, by the way. 11 tons. We don't have cooling yet. No, I can't do it. I can only get one of those bus saws. Let's buy it. Ah, there is no ammo for it. Damn it. Should have checked that beforehand. Heat bank. Gives you a heat capacity of 10. Nice. I'll buy that for a ton. Sure. Alright. So... We have to we have to build something with the things we have. We have no ammo for the bus saw, so we'll take an auto cannon five burst. It's fine. We'll take uh, ammo for the auto cannon five. We have one ton exactly. Funny. And um, double heat sinks. Capacity of two. Efficiency of zero point two. Those are better. I'll take one of those. They are more volatile, but okay. Take another double. Take the heat bank. Oh, that's big. Okay. So doubles are just better. And the protos do seem to be the same as the doubles. Interesting. Alright, guys. We have a build. One autocannon, two of those large continuous burst laser thingies that are hopefully good. And we're gonna start it. 43 days. Oh, God. Alright. Let's let's uh, let's get into a uh, fight again, right? Take a look at the star map. <sighs> 1 to 15 again. Uh, war zone? Maybe it's a good war zone. We have to take a look at those missions, guys. There's a raid and a defense contract. Defense is doable, even in higher tiers, because enemies will come in wave by wave. Okay, let's go. <laughs> I am in love with this already. And um, we have seen one, one mech that wasn't in the game before already. I think it was a wasp earlier. I wonder what else we're gonna see. So thank you for that mission. 25 should be doable. Defense, yeah, that's okay. I will take some salvage here. The seeple payout is not as good as it was before anymore. That's interesting. And we have a 200 limit drop tonnage. 200, yeah. Tons drop limit. That's what I want to say. Alrighty. You're gonna take that guy? Nope, you're gonna take that guy because you're good with missiles. And you're not good with missiles, but you have decent energy rating. So, this is our lands. We should also paint our mechs at some point. Let's ready up. That's gonna be the next part of it. 
I can see myself already be a barra broke all the time here. <laughs> Completely having no money. Okay, so... Hostile forces are looking to destroy this military outpost and destabilize the region. We have been contracted to defend this facility and prevent them from overrunning this position. Establish I don't know. A defensive perimeter um, and don't let any hostiles break through. How do I do it? Let's play it like that, maybe. Nothing on scopes at the moment, but don't get comfortable. Hostiles have been reported All right. in the area. All right, that's pretty good. That is pretty good, guys. Those are continuous burst beam lasers. That's so cool. I can just hold down the mouse button and they will they will continue shooting. It's pretty nice. So, here we are in our rifleman. I'm gonna tell my people that they should come with me because there's a, there's a lance of something coming up. Oh yeah, one of our friendlies is already dead now. Alright, there's a jav. Hello, Jav. Nope. Not yet. Try to soften them up as much as possible. Alright. What happens if I hold this? I mean, we kill a Javelin with that. Um, I don't know if I'm supposed to just do that. Like, spamming the button. No, I need to hold it in order to deliver the continuous damage. And sometimes the the um, uh, the particle effect will, you know, fade out. But I, th I think I still deal damage at that point. We need to check it out, guys. I'm so happy to have a rifleman already. Oh, this is beautiful. By the way, where, where are the last enemies here? Huh? There must be somebody. Oh, there you are. Alrighty. It's a wasp with the single medium laser. Alright. So, and he's all the way back there. Maybe our locust... No, the flea is gonna die. The flea is gonna die. Target destroyed. Actually... No! The lasers will stop firing every now and then. Ah, I need, I need to figure that out. The wasp is taking a lot of damage already. Also, the paper doll model seems to be a bit thicker than the other ones. Interesting. Alright, let's get some damage on the guy. Oh, he stopped moving. And I have 500 meters range on my laser beams. Let's go! Let me, let me check. I was trying to go for the leg continuously, but I have the feeling, hmm, that now I dealt full damage all the time. Interesting. By the way, it's so hard to uh, to play uh, a build like that, where you have to continuously trace your enemies with a hitscan weapon like our laser, and then lead your shot every now and then and shoot, so I have to take some breaks. And by the way, heat management is glorious here, so I can hold that for a while. And I think the heat bank also has a lot to do with that. We need to go back to base, by the way. Oh god, enemies are already on there. Woo. Okay, another wasp, a Jenner, pirate Jenner, and then something here on the left flank. No, not quite. No, not quite. Still not. There we go. Continuously bursting that guy. My reticle turns red all the time, so that's the cool thing. <laughs> Hey Wasp, how are you? I think we can use it as a brawl weapon quite nicely. Ah, oh, that's so good. That is so good, guys. Okay. So, I was thinking, dropping those... Those, um... What are they called? Uh, continuous lasers. And getting uh, regular lasers again. All the ones that are more focused and have a... Uh, what's it called? Uh, a lower laser duration? Maybe they are better. Having a longer cooldown is okay, because then I can manage my shots with my autocannon a bit better. Hey, there we go. Yep. And we can use the lasers. Man, those wasps have no armor whatsoever. Look at them. Look at him go! 
All right, another one. Seven out of 20. Oh God, there's still a lot of stuff to kill here. Hey, Jenner. Jenner, stop moving around that much, please. All right, Jenner, we're gonna go for your legs as well. Actually, let's go for center. Yeah, you will stay here, buddy. At the same time, I'm actually generating a good chunk of heat. Oh my freaking God. VTOL on approach. Right, that's good. I am running hot, guys. That is not good. Let's try to take that ego with the ballistic. Right. All right, we got him. Nice. So, back to the Jenner. <laughs> this is so good. I am having a blast here. What? It's okay. Whoops. Sorry. Get that Jenner, please. Oh, God. The problem that I'm seeing here with those lasers is that they take so long to actually deliver the damage. You can stay on target with them quite easily. Yeah, but... Ah. Come on. Take that guy. Auto cannon. You failed me, auto cannon. There we go. Try to take that thing down. Good. Nice. Pretty good. So, 16 out of 20. Yeah, I think we're gonna finish the mission quite nicely here. This is what I love about defense missions. They are rather easy because you have a base that the enemies will attack and prioritize and not your mechs necessarily. Okay, he's now. That is a J. Edgar. I think he's on our list as well. All right, so let's try to actually spam click that. Now, you really have to deliver the damage over time. So stay on target. And that's how you kill. That's okay. We did it. Hey, that's nice. So, uh, yeah, crazy, crazy thing, guys. We already have a rifleman. We have two light mechs that support us. We're gonna get another mech in order to, you know, finish our full lance of four mechs. And then we're gonna continue. Wow. I love that. I love that mod. It's pretty cool. New weapon systems, uh, new mechs to see, and a, a slightly different pace, I would say. And then there are also the new mission types that are coming from Coyote. Uh, there's a Pirate Jenner. Hmm. I will take the Pirate Jenner because it also comes with a supercharger and I've never really played with a supercharger. So let's check that out. We can also already take PPCs here, that's kind of funny. What about two AC2s instead of the one AC5? I don't know. It's, I think it's fine. It's fine like we played right now. So, Jenna, let me take a look at you. You're running some chem lasers. Hmm. Let me pick up the chem laser ammo so I can actually run it. And ideally, I'm gonna pick up some more chems, but those are tier one medium lasers. They are better than the things that we have right now. And I'd say... Seems good. Yeah, I'll take another jump jet for money, whatever. Ta-da! So, guys, our lance is complete. We have assembled four mechs. We need to fix the Jenner, fix our repair costs here, and then we can, we can continue. We also need a paint job, and then we can continue our playthrough, guys. That has been it the first... Uh, that has been it for today. That was the first episode of the modded playthrough, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to leave a rating, subscribe to the channel for more, and we're gonna continue tomorrow. Goodbye.